This is the Mustang Mach-E, a battery electric SUV from Ford, which carries a lot of the styling heritage and personality of the gas engine Mustang muscle car. I'm driving a premium electric all-wheel drive version of the Mach-E that has an 88 kilowatt hour extended range battery. That gives it an EPA estimated range of 270 miles on a single charge. The other models have up to 300 miles estimated range. This model can do zero to 60 in 4.8 seconds and has a starting price of $49,700. But because it's fully electric, it's eligible for a $7,500 federal tax credit. The Mustang Mach-E has five seats and as you can see over my shoulder, a panoramic glass roof. It's also packed with technology, a button to open each door. There's a 15.5 inch touchscreen center console that also has a manual dial for adjusting volume. You can control navigation, infotainment, vehicle settings, use the cameras for parking assistance and adjust a long list of driver assistance features. There's also a display behind the steering wheel which will show you your state of charge and range. Since Ford introduced the Mustang in 1964, it sold more than 10 million units. And the company's hoping that by integrating features like the pony car haunches and shark nose, the battery electric Mach-E will prove a hit too. There's three drive modes. Engage is for everyday driving. Whisper is the least aggressive, most forgiving of the drive modes. And then there's Unbridled, the most aggressive, most spirited of the drive modes. The Mach-E also has regenerative braking like a Tesla. In one pedal mode, by taking your foot off the accelerator, it slows the vehicle down by converting the car's kinetic energy back into stored energy in the car's battery. Ford has set up a US charging network in partnership with providers like Electrify America and ChargePoint. The Mark E's navigation system makes it easy to find fast chargers within the network. You can also search and pre-plan a visit to the charger in the Ford Pass app. From there, it's pretty easy. You can pull up to your chosen charger location, activate the charger using the Ford Pass app, and then monitor charging progress. It will also give you an estimated time for reaching an 80% and 100% state of charge. Later this year, Ford plans to roll out a hands-free driving system in the Marquee, similar to Tesla's Autopilot and GM's Super Cruise. Customers can opt for their Marquee to come with the hardware needed, but will have to wait and then pay for a software upgrade to get the semi-autonomous system. Ford has just started delivering the EV to customers in the US and expects annual sales of 50,000 units in the first year of production. The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.